hi guys and welcome to my youtube channel my name is kemi and if this is your first time you are welcome on this channel we do skincare product review um we do skin talk and i also sell skincare products so if that's something that you are interested in then just go straight to our website or you can chat with me anytime in today's video we are going to be doing skin talk and the reason why i'm actually doing this particular topic is because lately i've been getting a lot of questions about it so that means a lot of my clients and my customers are going through this so i thought let me bring it to the youtube and share with my youtube family so that you guys are well informed as well just in case any of you is going through this the topic for today is strawberry skin or strawberry legs which was whichever one you want to call it i'm gonna insert a picture on this video to show you exactly what this looks like i'm gonna put a couple of pictures so that you can see exactly what i'm talking about now i'm gonna be looking down at my notes because i make some notes so that i don't just talk on top of my head i speak fast so um this is something that occurs when um you know we have hair follicles on our skin so when the follicles or the pores are clocked and that is one of the reasons why you will get that bumpy things coming out of your skin. Um, this just contains dead, dead skin cell bacteria and oil that is trapped inside your air follicles. And that's why they come out like that, that bumpy thing. So, But if you have a lighter skin, this will be more visible than somebody who has a darker skin. So if your skin is light, then it's going to come out you know, looking really like profound but if you have a darker skin it might not even be noticeable now the appearance like i said check all the pictures that i'm going to insert in this video um it's like an open pause that looks darker than usual some of it is not black head because that's the mistake a lot of people are making it is not black head it is just air follicles that is poor that is um clogged with dirt um air or bacteria or dead skin cells or oil it is not black air they're not the same thing sometimes it also look like a small dots on your skin and some some people have it that it will look a little bit um, brownish while some will look black like I said depending on your skin color will determine you know the way it's going to appear now one of the main causes of this particular con condition I don't even know what to call it I think I'll just call it skin irritation is um when you shave or when you wax because when you shave your pores are open or when you wax it opens your pores and this is what happened like every time you have a shave try and use a warm water or a very cold water to wash that area for you to close your pores so that there's no room for dirt and hair and dead skin cells to leave so you need to do that if you go to um, a very good um spa for example for a wax most of the time once they have done the once they wax they will make sure they put something cold around that area so that the pores can close because if you don't close your pores back it will lead to strawberry legs so another thing that can actually cause this is called keratosis pilaris. Keratosis pilaris. So this is also called chicken legs, yeah, chicken skin. So this is when your skin produces too much keratin and blocked the hair follicles, causing it to bump out. The keratosis pilaris is a skin condition that happens when your skin produces too much keratin and this will now block your air follicles. So um, another cause of strawberry legs is enlarged pores. So um, those open commodos are caused by too much production of oil or sebum that normally clog the pores. So that's another reason why you might get that particular condition. Then another cause of strawberry leg is folliculitis. So this is caused by infected or inflamed swollen hair. So um, when your hair follicles become infected or swollen, then it can also cause something that will look like that strawberry legs. And it can be due to shaving as well, waxing, excessive sweat. If you're in an hot environment and you're always sweating, this is another thing that can cause 
folliculitis and those are the few things that i can pick up now it also if you have a dry skin don't let me miss that out if you have a dry skin you might also experience it so if you have a dry skin i'll suggest that you don't do waxing or shaving because if you do it might lead to strawberry legs so those are the four or five things that i'm going to mention as the cause of strawberry legs so how do we treat strawberry legs first you need to exfoliate that area I'm sure you are thinking maybe I'll give you one big thing that you can use. No, you don't actually need to use anything out of the ordinary. You need to get a very good exfoliant that will deeply exfoliate your skin. Or you can get a scrub that contains any AHA or BHA that will really, really help to get rid of that dead skin cells or that oil that is trapped in that area and it will expose it and then your pores will be closed this will help you to reduce the appearance of the strawberry leg and also prevent it from happening again if you are scrubbing that's why i always say if you don't understand how important exfoliating is in skincare you are missing out because not only is it going to make your skincare product to work better and faster it will always prevent all these kind of issues on your skin the second way to treat um strawberry legs will be to moisturize so after you have scrubbed that area then make sure you get a very very good moisturizing lotion or cream and moisturize daily like two three times a day Keep that place hydrated and moisturized. Then the third thing that I'm going to suggest is to use product that contain AHA, alpha hydroxide acid. So such as salicylic acid is amazing. Glycolic acid is very good. Lactic acid is also very good. So you can use something like amylatine. I think that contains lactic acid, which is an exfoliating and moisturizing lotion that you can use to treat your strawberry leg. You cannot also um, use um, like any product that contains AHA, even if it's a serum, a toner, a cleanser, you can also apply it on that affected area and it will really help to clear that on time. And then my third advice on how to treat is to avoid using hold razor. Make sure every time you want to shave, you use a brown new razor. And every time you need to shave, you apply a shaving cream before you shave. It helps to soften the skin and it helps to control the amount of irritation that you may get. So I hope this video is helpful. If you suffer from this, there's no need to go to your doctor unless if there's underlying illness. But if it is this strawberry legs, then it's something that you can take care of at home by yourself. Just exfoliate, moisturize, get your AHA or your BHA ready and you are good to go. And within a week, you will start seeing good, good results. If you're somebody that waxes and shaves, make sure you close your pores after get into a warm bath so that you can close your pores it's very very important for you to avoid having such issues or such irritation on your skin if you have ever experienced strawberry legs or strawberry skin please leave a comment in the comment section tell me your experience how did you deal with it and how long did it take for you to clear it and if you have not or you know somebody that have experienced it or is going through it right now then forward this video to them by sharing like this video guys Subscribe to this channel and follow us on Instagram. Until next time, guys, stay blessed.